Financial News Network. TFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the uh, Dow Industrials up 14, NASDAQ up 11, S&Ps up 2, gold. Gold up 490, trading at 1477 an ounce. We have silver up 4 cents, $16.99 an ounce. Oil up 20 cents, $59.37 a barrel. Notes and bonds. This is going to be the story out here today, folks. What you had with the note and bond market is this. We came down hard yesterday. Bottom line is that you hadn't made the lowest swing point. You make the lowest swing point today, guess what? Huge rejection of lower price. And the lowest swing point that we made was from the downdraft that had a huge amount of volume on November 7th. That's when we went from 129.11 to 127.30. We got to 127.29 today. It rejected it. You're at 128.22. That is saying bottom line is that notes and bonds are going higher once again. King dollar. King dollar's got a lot of movement. You had Boris Johnson, uh, bottom line, uh, get a decisive victory over in the U.K., that brings the probability much higher that uh, they're going to be out of the UK and uh, out of the European Union uh, quickly. Bottom line, dollar index gets smoked. Dollar index goes from a price point of a 97.515 up to down to 96.588. You're, down, you're, you're at 96.975 right now. Dollar index wants to run down to this lower swing point from the 25th of June, which is 95.834. Inside the S&P, folks, you can expect high volatility all day out here. China's going to have a news conference starting right now, and that, that's 10 o'clock their time uh, at night, not in the morning. Bottom line is that, uh, you know, yesterday, if you uh, looked at the news, bottom line looks like you have a deal. Uh, bottom line, even inside that deal, which was, uh, which was an absolute joke, actually, is that the, nothing was written about the agricultural buys, uh, what I expect we're going we're gonna to see out here is uh, bottom line is that you're going to go from a green market to a red market. And what we do know right now, though, this is what's pretty cool, folks, is that we do know because of the way that the news structure came out that, yeah, it's a deal. There was news stories actually at 3 o'clock in the afternoon that the deal is going to get signed. And the bottom line, we saw what the market did. The market got to the highs. And what do I mean by that? That we know what the highs that they got to with all positive news. Stay right there, folks. Tommy and I are coming right back. We have the Dow up 104. NASDAQ is up 37. S&P is up 12. Come right back.